so as you can see here is my fusion 360 right here inside my ubuntu system and uh, i just imported a uidf uh, just to visualize the data and that's it i just imported a uidf model into my rvs into my ROS system and yeah so yeah that's how you install autodesk fusion 360 for ubuntu hello everyone this is karthik and welcome to rick Bitter labs so with the thumbnail of the video you would have already guessed what this video is all about i found a solution that will change your workflow as a robotics engineer forever introducing fusion 360 for ubuntu i'm not even kidding this is legit now you can now run autodesk fusion 360 on your very own ubuntu machine design your robots and then convert it into uidf within the whole system itself having more than three years of experience as a ROS developer i've encountered same obstacles as even you might be familiar with the constant back and forth between windows and ubuntu while creating and testing your robots is hell of a task so today i'm here to give you a step-by-step -step instruction on how you can install autodesk fusion 360 on your very own ubuntu machine Let's note that this is a beta version of Fusion, so I do not recommend it for professional or higher priority tasks. But for minor projects, this will be your lifesaver. Also, I want to give a big shout out to Thermionix, who has a detailed GitHub repository on how to install Fusion 360 on Ubuntu. I took some reference from it, and uh, by doing some debugging and putting my own efforts over it, I was able to crack this and install Fusion 360 on Ubuntu. So now, I'm going to show you how even you can install Fusion on your own Ubuntu machine. So take your computers and follow along with me. But before we get started, make sure to hit the subscribe button as we are going to come up with this type of content very frequently. Now, back to the video. The process is pretty much simple. Uh, firstly, just go to the GitHub repository that I'll add uh, in the description below. Uh, you can see the GitHub screen in front of you. Uh, yeah. Just scroll down, uh, you will see the command that you have to enter. You just copy that command and yeah, open a new terminal, paste the command and just let it install itself. So as you can see, it uh, is installed on my PC. Uh, it was previously installed, so all the prerequisites were already there on my PC, so it installed uh, pretty quick but in your case uh, it might take some while now if we just scroll down on the github you'll find a different repo just to open fusion 360 you just have to copy copy it and yeah a few moments later so it takes a while to open the first time it uh, compiles all the things so just stay tuned. So yeah, uh, this is how uh, it got installed. Now you just have to sign in, uh, put your credentials and we can get into Fusion 360. And that's it actually. Uh, you just installed Fusion 360 on your Ubuntu system. Uh, now I'll also create a URDF. We'll have to add plugins and all those things. I'm sure you uh, are aware of how to add URDF plugins. So we'll add URDF plugins and then uh, maybe create a URDF so that we can verify our uh, Fusion that we just installed. So the UIDF plugin has been added. Now I'll just uh, open any simple design just to show you how to create a UIDF using Fusion 360 on Ubuntu. So I've imported my very own model uh, and now I'll be working on creating the UIDF for this. I'll just go to utilities, add-ins, scripts. UIDF exporter and just select my home location that's it so the UIDF has been created now let's just check 
whether we can see the no idea you want to test it let's create a new folder back in workspace see it from here and into the packing workspace yes so yeah cd let's stop packing workspace I'll do a quick packing make here. And launch launch. See if there's the word description. Display dot launch. And yes, that's how you can see your CFS model imported right into your uh, ROS system and we created it using Fusion for Ubuntu so yeah congratulations on that if you are still watching this video then I am sure that you found this video very interesting and helpful so do press the like button and also share it with your friends also if you want to meet us and more such fellow ROS developers I would insist you to join us at Roscon India 2023 happening on 14th and 15th of December at IIC Bangalore so if you don't know what's Roscon, it's basically a developers conference and unlike any other meetup or paper presentation conference, Roscon includes robotics expos and demos, talks, panel discussions and a lot, lot and lot of networking. To know more or register for the event, head to the description box below or the pinned comment section. So head over to the website right now if you don't want to miss the early bird offers. Do tell us in the comment section on what topics you want to see more videos from us. Until then, this is Madhur signing off and I'll see you in the next video. Okay, bye.